morning guys, it's Adam Cooper from My Halifax and for this week's My Halifax we've come down to Long Lake Provincial Park um, it's a little cloudy but I actually know it's going to be a really nice day because everything just feels really fresh and super fun <laughs> So actually I got a lot of my information from trails.com which is actually a really good website and it's one of the things I've always liked about Halifax is you can always find a local website to give you lots of information. Trails.com has basically all the provincial parks you can go and walk through. So if you ever want to find a kind of, kind of a hidden gem or find a place where you think I want to go and see how long it would take me to go and find that how long it will walk, that's a really good website. <laughs> So the nice thing about this actual trail is it was unmarked for a long time and um, during 2016 it was all, all the roads and everything that we walked the trails were put in so it's really fresh it's really new it's very clean so like there's washrooms here there's places to park your bikes there's just a lot of things that you know make it feel like very fresh and very new which i know i just said that but that's how it feels and we're doing the with road loop which will take us all the way around the lake So the new section, which is like the trail loop, that's about 5k, um, but the park itself has over 2,000 hectares of land, so it's a really, really big park. It's not always as well signed as the new pod is, but that's just part because it's been around since like the early 80s, I believe. Um, it reminds me very much of kind of like Point Pleasant Park, Mercy River, it's just a really nice walk. So one of the reasons I really like this park is because it's actually just right up north of Starm, so it's really, really close. So if you live in the city, it's just one of those parks that you can access quite easily. And that's one of the nice things about Halifax is there's a lot of parks like that, kind of like Point Pleasant Park is. So it's really cool that we can just literally hop in your car, drive down here and have a great day and just enjoy a Sunday morning. I think the nice thing about this park is it's really good if you like want to cycle, if you want to run. There's a lot of people actually out here running right now, which makes me feel kind of bad because I'm just walking really slowly, but yeah, what can you do? Um, but you know, there's also the lake, so you can paddle too. Further down the other end of the park, there's actually a public access, so you can like launch a boat or launch a canoe from there. You could probably do it from the lake down here, but it's like not really an official launch spot, so that'd be kind of dicey. But um, it's nice that you have something like this so close to like in the city because it's places like this that build a community and that's the kind of place where like if you have little ones or you know you want to move somewhere you can come here as like a place for exercise, a place to you know take your kids and that's just that's what makes the community. So that's the end of this week's My Halifax. This is my first time on the uh, new trail. I have to I really like it. There was a lot of people that were kind of out and about being really active and there was someone going fishing too which I thought was quite cool. Um, you can just tell that this is going to be like the centre for a lot of people and part of the community um, which is really nice because I mean it's things like this that make a community. Um, all the information I got about this place uh, I got from trails.com which I'm going to link in the description below. If there's anywhere you think we should make a video please let us know in the comments below and don't forget to subscribe to our channel and you click the bell icon and you'll get notified whenever we upload. So thank you for watching, don't forget to like, comment and subscribe and we'll see you next week. I'm really enjoying this walk. Mm-hmm. <laughs>